Hi there! We are used to the fact that mothers take much more care about the young in the animal and human world. But do you know that in some species, devoted fathers do their best to make sure the next generation has every chance to survive? Today, animal-like people will show you 12 incredible examples of extraordinary fathers in the animal kingdom. Eleven, Responsible Gorilla Fathers Gorilla father has to rule a clan of approximately 30 gorillas. His main task is to find food for his group, which is a great job, as one gorilla usually eats up to 50 pounds of food per day. A gorilla dad is also very protective. He watches all the threats for the clan and scares away enemies by fiercely beating his chest. He often has to fight off other male gorillas who typically try to kill baby gorillas when aiming to take over the group. Gorilla Dad spends a lot of time with their young until they become teenagers. He attentively teaches his offspring and play with them. Besides, he always sets any arguments that arise between siblings. So, male gorilla are great fathers. 10. Red-tailed dads Male red foxes are astonishing fathers. They are very talented caregivers. Of course, they enjoy playing and roughhousing with their pups, as most animals and human dads do. While the pups are little, the fox father hunts every day, providing food for all the cubs and their mother. When the young are about three months, they experience a rough awakening. Forget about free food. Be ready to find it by yourselves. The father stops feeding them as a tactic to get the pups to leave the den. But he doesn't leave them starving. He just buries food close to the den to help teach them how to sniff and forage for food. It makes a great deal in learning how to survive when grown up. 9. African Wild Dog Fathers African wild dogs resemble domesticated dogs greatly. Their pups are also very playful and active, just like ordinary pups are. Spending a lot of calories per day, they need a lot of food. But their mom's milk is not enough. They need real meat. As the pups are unable to eat solid foods until they are about 10 weeks old, their father catches the prey, swallows it, and then regurgitates the softer version for the pups to eat. It is the way the dad makes sure his children get enough nourishment. There is another purpose of this practice. Since the pups have to rely on their fathers for food, it keeps them from wandering too far from home, so they don't fall prey to enemies. 8. Nice Little Monkey Fathers It is a great challenge for golden lion tamarind males to become fathers. When their children are two weeks old, their fathers start carrying them on their backs for near 24 hours per week. Dad hands them over to their mother one at a time every two to three hours. Then she nurses and feeds the baby for around 15 minutes and hands it back to its father. The infants ride on the father's back until they are six to seven weeks old. When infants are four weeks old, they begin to eat soft food. Now the father has not only to carry his children on his back, but to feed them too. Now his job is to peel and mash bananas and hand feed them to his offspring. What great fathers and husbands these little creatures are. 7. Feathered Feminist Fathers Male flamingos are outstanding and good fathers for all the world. Being surrounded by thousands of birds in the flock, these guys remain monogamous, mating with one special female for life. Flamingo dads believe in gender equality and share all the responsibility, which is rare in the animal kingdom. When it comes time to mate, dad helps mom select a nesting site, and together they build the nest out of mud. When a female lays her egg, the father incubates the egg together with her by turns. And once the hatchling is born, mom and dad share all parenting duties equally. So, Flamingo is really dream fathers. 6. Stickleback Fish Dads But do you know that there are a lot of good fathers among fish species? We think not many of you heard about this small fish, which is called Stickleback. Nevertheless, the males take the main responsibility for offspring. They build nests in the rivers, 
using algae, sand and debris, which they glued together using a protein called spigen, formed in their kidneys. The dads gather together clutches of eggs from a number of different females and fertilize them. They are very protective, keeping the eggs safe in the nest. The male fish then guards the eggs and young fry until they are strong enough to swim away. 5. Emperor Penguins Sacrificing Dads These fathers embrace their parental duties at great personal sacrifice. A male penguin takes egg-setting duties for weeks, while mom heads to sea to hunt fish for her soon-to-hatch offspring. The point is that dad's belly fat, called the brood flap, keeps the egg fixed on their feet, warm, while the dad patiently waits for his partner to come back. What? While doing this very important job, the father will loose up to half his body weight. If the egg hatches, the poor dad regurgitates what's left in his stomach to support the chick until mom returns to take over the nurturing. The males are so important to the reproducing process that females seek out chubby partners who can sit on eggs longer without food. 4. Red-necked phalarope's unexpected role Do you know what a red-necked phalarope is? It is a medium-sized bird, living in cold regions like Arctic, Iceland or Scotland. The most interesting thing about these birds is that males and females has turned the tables during the evolutionary development. The female phalarope is much more colorful. She does all the courtship displays and singing. The male, on the contrary, keeps the eggs warm and looks after the young. His dull colored feathers help keep him camouflaged while sitting on the nest. Besides, the female chases males and competes with other females for a breeding territory. Of course, the female lays the eggs, but that's where her involvement stops. 3. Loving Water Bug Dads Giant water bugs are famous for their painful bite, but they are also famous for their great and tender fatherhood. After mating, the female water bug glues a brood of about 150 eggs to her mate's back, leaving him to rear the youngsters. He carries his future offspring around for the following weeks, airing them out and combing his legs through the eggs periodically, protecting them from fungal infection. He does it until they hatch. Being a giant water bug is a great and important job. 2. Rad Re Dads Rad Re males are extremely interesting creatures. Being a polygamous bird, Rad Re keeps a harem of up to a dozen females, but he can still win Father of the Year. These dedicated fathers, after they've mated with multiple ladies, build nests for the eggs of all the impregnated females. And they incubate the eggs and raise the chicks on their own while his ladies do their best relaxing. So, Red Wee males can really be named seriously devoted single dads. He makes a formidable bodyguard for his youngsters. 1. Seahorse Pregnant Dad And the last but the most incredible dad is the seahorse male and the most unbelievable and desired husband too. They not only get pregnant, brooding eggs in their pouch, but they're monogamous and so mate for life. When the female is ready to lay eggs, it connects a tube, called ovipositor, to the male's pouch, through which she delivers her eggs. The male fertilizes the eggs inside his pouch. Then he keeps them snug for two to three weeks. The good guy monitors the salt levels inside his pouch to be sure they match the surrounding environment to keep the baby seahorses healthy. These practically ideal fathers does it all over again with the same mate, remaining monogamous for their lives. As you can see, not only moms can be good parents in animal world, some fathers can become the winners in this race and their parental behavior can impress everyone. We see the same tendency in our human world. There are some extremely devoted and tender fathers that support their children better than some moms. We hope our video was informative and useful for you. Tell us, 
what case from our top was completely unknown for you. See you next time!